right, in this video, I'm going to show you a way to scrape valid email addresses from uh, Apollo. Um, so you don't have to pay for a bunch of extra credits and things like that. So at the moment with Apollo, if you go over to your profile and you go over to manage plan, you'll see that the export credits usage is really annoying. You only get 500, but you get like 10,000 emails, right? Um, so one way around this, instead of having to export and you hit the limit and pay for more and everything like that, one way is to use a tool called Instant Data Scraper. So Instant Data Scraper is just a Chrome extension. I mean, quite literally just get it on Chrome, just type in Instant Data Scraper, uh, add it, it's free. It's got loads of good reviews and everything. Just pin it to the bar. So once you're on Apollo, uh, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna go over to search, do your regular search. This isn't a video where I'll show you how to do searches. That's for a separate video. But I'm just gonna show you how it works um, and an example. So I'm just gonna pull this list here. Uh, that we've done recently. Um, and what you want to do is firstly on Apollo, before you just click this and export, you're going to want to, um, so you're going to say, for example, you do your search, you do your whole thing, um, and you pull this, pull this list. Um, there's going to be like a total number here. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to select all of them. Uh, and Apollo only ever lets you select up to 2000 at a time. So you're going to select all of them that you've got, and you're going to go to add to list, add to lists. What this does is this then verifies or finds the email addresses, right? So I've already got this in a list, so you don't need to do that, but you would click like add to list, um, and then you would come over to your save lists, and then it would be here in your save lists. And then that means that the emails are available basically, right? Um, and you can do all of this, by the way, on just the 49 a month, uh, 49 bucks a month plan. So um, you get 10K emails, 10K verified emails. Now you're gonna obviously have to put them through a verification tool, but you get 10K emails that you can export um, and that you can use data scraper and everything like that for. Um, now, what you're going to want to do is you're just very quickly, you're going to want to go over to table layout, uh, and then you're going to go, um, and I've already got it set to emails layout, um, but you want to just imagine you were to do this for the first time, you click on edit, and then you can click over to columns and just make sure that the email column is selected. Um, just because if it's not, then it won't always export or scrape the email data. So now that we've got this as a column, it's going to basically export or scrape all of these different things, right? Um, and amazingly, it's uh, pulling their numbers as well, which is fantastic. So if you want their mobile numbers, they're also here as well. So what you do here is once you're in your save lists, so you click over onto here, you'll come over to your save list. You'll click on select all people. Now I've already done this, but um, you're gonna select all people, right? And you can see down here that it is, I'm gonna have to move myself real quick. Bump. Um, so yeah, so you see all here. here. So once you've selected it, you're gonna click uh, on this and then it's going to say locate next button so just click on that it'll take you back to this page just click around and just make sure that this thing's green right and it will say here it will say next button located and then press start crawl so when it says press start crawling then that's when you do it and then you'd quite literally just go start crawling and then it will come back onto this page and just stay on this page go do something else whatever just leave it for a little bit obviously this is going to take a little while but you get the point right um and then once it's finished it will go through if it crashes if it does anything like that just click start uh, start crawling again because it will stop um or just refresh it try it again things like that sometimes i've had some issues but normally nine times out of ten it's pretty good um, and it works just fine but yeah if there's any issues just restart it or refresh the page or just start the thing again um, and then, yeah, that's pretty much it. So once you go over to here and let's just to say I stop crawling, right? I stop crawling. Um, you'll see the columns. Now my columns look a little bit different to yours. There'll be like some random letters and numbers here. I've just changed the names of mine because this is what, uh, I want to export and I download this as a CSV and then I'll put it in clay, for example. Um, you want to get rid of all these extra things if they're not useful to you. Um, so I would just delete them. And then this is what normally they look like. So yeah, I would just delete all of these, just get rid of that, get rid of all this stuff. Um, and then, yeah, that's pretty much it. Then you'd have the columns that you want and you quite literally just click uh, CSV download, or you can copy all and then paste them into a Google sheet or something like that. Right. And then you've got here all your leads from Apollo. Now you'll be able to uh, scrape and export around, um, around yeah 10,000 basically um, the max you can do at one go is 2,000 um, if you're on the $49 a month plan um, and then if you want more just what I do is I just set up multiple Apollo accounts and then for two accounts it's 100 bucks three accounts 150 bucks and so on and so forth so that's how it works and yeah hopefully you found this video useful and uh, thanks